Raucous home support, as you would expect. And plenty of travelling Welsh supporters as well. Steve Tandy's men have fought so hard to put themselves in pole position. Any kind of win today, and they're into the quarterfinals for the first time since 2010. It'd be rich reward for a campaign that saw them claim two bonus points from each of their trips to France. And scoring for fun this season. Eight tries in all for the big number eight. Yendel's that close. Start full of meaning, full of purpose from the Exeter Chiefs. Leonard. New Zealander again, releasing him up the middle. Oh, that's powerful work. Another meaningful burst. Pile of bodies. Waldrum's after it again. Look at him. He's in there burrowing. He fancies it. Waldrum! He's got it. Of course he has. Steenson. Little nudge through. Big chase on here from Short. It's going to fall for it beautifully. Short is away. And he's shaking off the defenders. And he's powering his way in. Releasing Dolman in acres of space. And guess who's on the outside? Short pinning his ears back and driving over for number two. Excellent work from the Ospreys pack. This is looking very promising. Penalty try. And it's a penalty try. Another little burst from Tayone. Is it those last oh, couple of meters take so long? Exeter finally have found a way over the whitewash. Thomas Waldron with two, James Short with two. Where does it leave them? 33 points to 17. Stunning performance when seemingly they had no sniff at all. They now have a chance.